turned the timber over and uh, saw two more slabs. I got the first one on the saw horses already. And it was okay, no crotch figure in it, but it was pretty interesting what was going on at the top of it. But this one right here on the underside toward the heart of the tree should have plenty of good uh, crotch figure in it. what we got. Clean off this side first and it was closest to the bark of the tree so I'm doubting there's any crotch figure in here. It's probably gonna be on the underside closest to the hardwood. Still some nice walnut here on this side of the board. So you can see right here the grain is coming up swirling this way. And it also done the same thing on this slab beside of it. Now, this is some nice figure. Now, this slab has this same figure right here and it makes for a really nice slab. There's nothing wrong with it. But as you can see, the crotch is starting to come into play because the grain is, is swirling around. It's wanting to shoot out this way. And when we turn the slab over, it should be going this way toward this other fork here of the tree. And we should have some fantastic crotch figure right there. So we'll flip it over and uh, see what happens. When you're flipping uh, slabs around that have crotch figure, man, you want to be careful and not to drop them. Because that crotch figure is highly vulnerable to cracking because it's very weak wood where it goes in two different directions. I think we're gonna knock it out of the park right here on this one. It looks nice right there. It looks like there might be a little bit of a pith running in here though does i center the pith on this slab i think this is the one that has the pith yes so the pith is in this slab so uh you know one of your slabs is always going to have the pith in it there's nothing you can do about that every tree has it might make for some interesting figure here in the middle and there's some cracking that runs this way parallel to the bark and that's because of the pith of the tree well, that's that's pretty neat right there we got our crotch running both ways here in the middle and the pith is in there you know, we can kill and dry this slab and put some epoxy in here to stabilize it, and it'll be just fine. I can't tell you how nice it is to have water right beside the meal. No more having to haul it around. Put a little water on here, see what happens. Oh, yeah. Nice stuff right there. No matter. 